So this drink is a small rocks glass or an old-fashioned glass. Um, typically old fashions go in there. And the shape of the ice cube fits perfectly in this drink. Um, and I'm going to make a Port Monroe, which tastes very similar to an old-fashioned. It involves an aged tiki rum, a little bit of demerara syrup, sassafras and sorghum bitters, and Angostura bitters. This is a coupe. Um, typically drinks go in this glass that don't have ice, and I'm gonna make a Blue's Clues in this one. For the coupe glass, I'm gonna be making Blue's Clues, which includes bramble, a blueberry honey syrup, and lemon. This is called a Collins glass. Um, I'm going to be putting a Tom Collins into this, uh, which is the namesake of the glass. And that includes gin, lemon, and simple syrup. This is a Pilsner, and typically drinks of higher volume will go into this glass. Um, and I will be making a new beach. Which includes coffee liqueur, pineapple juice, cream, and cherry syrup. This is a Belgium glass, and I'm going to be making the Salad Liberation Front. And that includes Terra Botanical Gin, Carrot Juice, Lemon, and Simple Syrup, shaken with Cucumber and Dill. And this is your traditional Moscow Mule mug. Any drink in the Mule family is going to go into a copper mug. For the Mule mug, I'm going to make the traditional Moscow Mule with vodka, lime, and ginger beer.